Jalakatu. Jalakatu protest, Subramanian Swami faces massive ire for using term Purakis. Swami's relentless name calling has caused an explosive reaction from pro Jalakatu protesters, who see a grave insult to all Tamilians. Thursday, January 19, 2017. The pro Jalakatu protests on the ground in Tamil Nadu have been completely peaceful, but social media is a different beast altogether. A major target of protesters' ire on social media is BJP MP Subramanian Swami, thanks to his tweets calling the protesters, Porakis, which roughly translates to rowdies or thugs. Swami first kicked off tempers on Twitter when he tweeted that any Jalakatu events transgressing the Supreme Court ban should invite President S. Rule in Tamil Nadu. Subramanian Swami? At Swami 39. If Jalakatu is held without awaiting SC judgment permitting it and TN government fails to enforce the law, Centre must declare President's rule. January 12, 2017. Going on the offensive from this point, Swami accused the pro Jalakatu protesters of showing bravado on social media, but quietly bowing down to the police machinery when it was deployed. Subramanian Swami? At Swami 39. It is like Porakis in Tien who despite we being a democracy will talk violent action. But when government machinery goes into action they whimper. January 13, 2017 The online war of words began to heat up when Swami invoked the National Investigative Agency, NIA, against the protesters on January 17, even as protests on the ground began to pick up tempo. Subramanian Swami? At Swami 39. All Porakis in Tamil Nadu who have been threatening violence on Twitter against PTs should write out their addresses for NI inspection. January 17, 2017. When Twitter users hit back at him for it, Swami went on the offensive. Subramanian Swami? At Swami 39. Why are Porakis getting nervous when I want their address? Fear? Stalin has CRP cover and MK has black cats from center? Why not TN police? January 17, 2017 Most of this relentless war of tweets and counter-tweets has taken the form of repetitive name-calling, as Swami and those opposed to his comments slink crass comments at each other. Going by his tweets, you'd think Swami was against Jalakatu. But in the BJP leader's case, the truth is usually more complicated than that. In fact, Subramanian Swami is arguing the case in Supreme Court to lift the ban on the bull taming sport. When one of his PTS, patriotic tweeple, questioned the legitimacy of several leaders' claims that they support Jalakatu, and claimed that only Subramanian Swami actually did something about the issue, Swami endorsed the tweets, while continuing his name calling of protesters. Jagdish Shetty at Jagdish Shetty. TN politics due to evil influence of film culture has produced morons who spread disinformation, Dr. At Swami 39 different. January 18, 2017. In his own words, on request of many Tamils I argued in SC for Jalakatu. But Poraki slide that I opposed it exclamation mark. Subramanian Swami? At Swami 39. PTs know now these howling nuts as Porakis. On request of many Tamils I argued in SC for Jalakatu. But Porakis lied that I opposed it. January 15, 2017. But this defense has been completely buried in the noise generated by Swami's persistent name-calling and insults. Online and on the ground at Marina Beach. Protesters are enraged at what they see as Swami's inability to understand Tamil culture and behave in a cultured manner himself. Hash justice for Jal Lakata Timisiki I. At Mkidjisir Mr. at Swami 39 calling all hash ningsters as hash Porakis is thr any way to hash file a hash case on him. Kindly hash guide us hash Jal Lakatu protest. January 19, 2017. Subramanian Swami? At Swami 39. 
All Portuguese in Tamil Nadu who have been threatening violence on Twitter against PTs should write out their addresses for NIA inspection. Gokulnath Venagopal at I underscore am underscore goks. At Swami 39, Mr. Dot Swami, we are Indians and proud Tamilians fighting to save our culture. Don't disgrace us as Porakis. Hash justice for Jalakatu. January 19, 2017. A number of memes mocking Swami have also cropped up on numerous Facebook groups, including some that have been recycled from the past. Narendran, 29, working in a travel agency, is one of the protesters at Marina to voice his ire against Swami. He told TNM, whatever Swami says is not right in any way. He does not know anything about our culture. We bring up bulls like our daughters. Another student protester hit out at Swami, saying, Subramanian Swami is unfit to be in politics and no one has any right to say anything about our protest for our culture. We are protesting to save our culture. Many of the voices raised against Swami have lashed out at the BJP leader for making such abusive comments even as their protests have stayed completely peaceful and even earned the praise of the local police for it. Chennai Memes at Memes Chennai Pambala Puraki at Swami 39 called us Purakis. We responded by conducting peaceful protests in a manner that even TN police appreciated us. January 18, 2017 Tamil celebrities like RJ Balaji also hit out at Swami. Speaking to the media, Balaji said, You just have to came to any city in Tamil Nadu to know what kind of protest this is. Maybe Gandhiji in the pre-independence era has protested in a silent, peaceful way. That is exactly what is happening right now. It is a protest that India has never seen in the past decades after independence. He also added that the pro Jalakata movement was completely led by students and had no hidden political agendas behind it. Chenates at Chenates FB At RJ underscore Balaji emotional address to national media in Vok Park. Coimbatore. January 18, 2017. Politician and actor Kushbu also hit out at Swami for his use of the term Puraki, insinuating that he was referring to himself when he used it. Kushbusunder? At Kushsunder. I request my friends not to get angry when a self proclaimed intellect calls us hash porky. Understand he was looking at the mirror and commenting.